Many of you have been with us right from the start and witnessed the Biden journey so far. And as you've seen in this film, it has been quite an exciting and fast-paced journey. One might say we're on a fast forward to the future. I'm part of this journey. My name is Henrik, and I'm the Vice President of Marketing at Biden. And herewith, I welcome you to the future. To that we say, it's about time. It's about time that we all, you and I, stop wasting time while being stuck in traffic. It's about time that all facets of your digital world finally coexist in your car. It's about time because, yes, time is of the essence. Once spent, we are not getting any of it back. It's gone forever. This is why we at Biden are dedicated to giving time back to you, to taking the downtime, the lost time in traffic, and making it more enjoyable and productive. We are dedicated to giving you personal time to be yourself. We create time for you by leveraging the newest technology available so that you have your personal time to be. So the Biden team has, been, has on, been on an incredible journey since we founded the company in 2016. In 2017, we officially launched the Biden brand, and exactly one year ago, we stood here on this stage for the world premiere of our Biden M-Byte concept. Yes, and today, after one year, we now have two vehicles, the Biden M-Byte and also the Biden K-Byte. And what you see here, the Biden m -Byte concept is 80 to 90% representative of the Biden m -Byte, which you will see on the road by the end of this year. And today, our vision, which inspired us originally to set up this company, not even three years ago, to make the time you spend traveling by car more enjoyable and more productive, will become a reality in 2019. It's the introduction of the Byte and M Byte. In 2019, it's about time we deliver on our promise and we bring our vision to reality. So, how could we achieve this? To design and develop the Byte and M Byte, we built upon our extensive automotive expertise and we created a tech company with digital technology as our core competency. To achieve this milestone, we went from thinking mechanically to thinking digitally. And the innovative and stylish Python M Byte delivers our vision. So ladies and gentlemen, please make up your mind and take a look. So the Byte and M Byte brings what we call the smartphone moment to the world of mobility. And it's doing so by combining two state-of-the-art platforms. The first one is our EV platform. It has a range of uh, up to 325 miles, along with an affordable starting price around 45,000 US dollars. And doing so, the Byte and M Byte provides functionality and capability for everyday usage. And it is ready for level three autonomous driving. The second platform is our own open 
digital cloud platform, which we call Byton Life. And Byton Life connects your applications, your data, and your devices to one ecosystem. So together, these two platforms transform those four wheels into what we call the next generation smart device, integrating all aspects of your digital life, all while on the move, or while standing still in traffic jams, or whenever. So in other words, the Byton M-Byte could become the most important device in your digital life, and we are very much convinced, convinced that it will do so. The Byte and Mbyte reinvents and transforms your journey through the use of artificial intelligence and machine learning. And now it's about time that you see what you will experience once you take delivery of your Byte and Mbyte and sit inside. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a world premiere. No one saw it before. I'm happy to present you the serial production user interface of the first Byte and car or Byte and Mbyte. Enjoy. Swipe, pinch, field, So ladies and gentlemen, now it's time to have a closer look to this great design. And there's somebody here to talk about this great design who can do it better than anyone else. It's our Vice President of Design. Let's welcome Benoit Jacob. Thank you, Karsten. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome. 
when we, exactly one year ago, revealed that the Embiid concept here on this very stage, uh, I must say that has been a truly exciting journey for the design team. And but what I can also tell you is uh, we, of course, uh, revealed, uh, left alone this car, uh, many of the images of this interior. What you see here is the concept car. And I can tell you, over the last year, uh, talking with some of you, media, uh, friends, colleagues, no one would really believe uh, that we would bring uh, what you see here as reality. No one would believe we would be able to bring such of a large screen and the components or the user interface that Dan Carsten just described. But what I can tell you, or confirm again today over the picture that you just say, uh, saw, we just did it. And uh, there's a small morphing that demonstrates that. Uh, it takes just a second. Uh, that really demonstrate that uh, this interior is no longer uh, uh, reality. I need to see now the next uh, morphing. Yeah, that's exactly what happens. And look at that. This is the production interior. This is really what we're going to bring uh, at the end of the year in the street. And this is, I must say, uh, probably as a designer, I can speak also for my team, this is probably the first time ever. Typically, a show car will promise a lot, uh, and you will eventually uh, find back in the production car some very small details, maybe some hints, but never the big picture. And this is truly unique. That's also the mission that I gave to the design team, to simply do the production car better than the show car, make it more futuristic, make it, of course, safer, make it also ergonomically better. This is the task that we uh, simply took. It's a big challenge. But we believe that we were able, actually, to make a step further in terms of design refinement against this concept car. But uh, now, uh, to conclude shortly, uh, it would be now more important to know what can you really do uh, with this vehicle, because what you see is, of course, uh, I believe, interesting. But I think even more interesting is what is exactly the experience that you will be able to achieve or have uh, within this car. And I would like, for this very reason, uh, call on stage uh, my two colleagues, or call back Enric and uh, Abe Chen. Uh, we, we will uh, basically give you a clear insight about the user interface concept. Thank you, Benoit. Thank you. Thank you, Benoit. <laughs> <laughs> Woo, what a great time to be alive, right? With all the technology development going on, it seems anything is possible. There's so much going on, actually, that we easily get distracted. Our goal at Byton is to use technology and at the same time reduce distractions. In other words, Byton's goal is to generate meaningful innovation, meaningful experiences, better experiences in your vehicle. Now we're going to talk about artificial intelligence. We're talking about artificial intelligence machine learning to a level never seen before in a vehicle. Let's look at a real life example. Something you might be familiar with. Say a couple is on the road, it's near dinner time. Each person has a different food preference. What they ate for lunch today or dinner yesterday. Mary might want seafood. She's thinking about fish, taco, shrimp, lobster. At the same moment, Peter's hungry, right? Peter wants a filet mignon or ribeye on the bone with a, maybe a nice baked potato. Think it'll lead to disagreement. Have you ever been in this situation before? Now imagine your Biden knows all this information up front about you. It knows the time of day, how long you've been on the road, your destination, how much longer your trip will be, what you like to eat. And your Biden is able to come up with a dinner recommendation or options. Your Biden could even ask if you would like to make a reservation. This leads to less stress, fewer distractions, higher quality of life, it's a seamless experience. Your buy makes a connection, a meaningful recommendation for you. Meaningful experiences in your Biden. Biden life also enables Biden experiences outside of the car. A prime example is our Biden app. At Biden, we follow a one app strategy. The Biden app is an all-in-one solution for all customer touch points. In the future, you will be able, of course, to have all car-related functions in this app. But we are not just launching an app and apps for every single functionality, as many other players do it right now. And then, of course, you're completely lost 
because there are so many apps out there that you don't know which app is, using for, uh, is uh, applicable for which action. So this is why we follow this one app solution. We introduced the Byte and K-Byte concept last June at the Asia CES in Shanghai, and I'm happy to announce that internal development is now underway with a targeted market introduction of our K-Byte concept in 2021. The momentum is building and the pace is accelerating at Byton. We will continue to grow by expanding our global footprint, by adding to our talent pool, and by bringing new innovative smart devices to the market. Now, 2019 is a pivotal year for Byton. We are really proud of Byton's growth and our team's achievement in 2018, but we are far from done. The momentum continues in 2019. We have to move towards full market and retail readiness. Yes, and regarding retail readiness, on January 17th, the just next week, the first Byton place opens in Shanghai. And this is where consumers will have the opportunity to see and touch the Byton m -Byte concept. And the Byton plates will also offer a look at the future of premium mobility. Byton Place Shanghai is the first of its kind, and many more will follow. It combines automotive and digital literacy to create an all-sensory immersion into the world of Byton. Within this inspiring space, visitors can interact with Byton product specialists, and they will be able to explore our innovative technology via virtual reality and augmented reality. And we will also be using this space to connect people, such as media, with our designers, engineers, and executives located around the world via interactive online presentations. For those of you who are coming to Shanghai, we sincerely invite you to stop by and experience the Biden Place. And there's more than that. We will be sharing additional news about the Biden M production car in the upcoming Shanghai Auto Show in April. And in June, we will celebrate the Byton's m -Byte world premiere at the Byton Night at Asia CES. And finally, production of the Byton m -Byte begins, as said before, end of 2019. And to say, we say it's about time. Byton is reality. We are bringing to market a smart device on wheels that will help you make the best of your time while driving. And now, unfortunately, time is almost up for this press conference. Yes, and we look forward to sharing more of the Byton story with you at our booth at CS. And we are in the North Hall, booth 8515. Please stop by to get an up-close look at the Byton M-Byte and Byton K-Byte concepts, or to interact with the Byton AI tech wall, which you might have seen in the lobby before the press conference and to find out more about the Amazon Alexa and Byton partnership. And also, we are very honored that the Byton m -Byte concept is displayed on the Amazon Alexa Auto Booth, number 7506, located in the North Hall. 